Welcome to this video about Milestones Professional. Today we'll be adding symbol text and symbol notes to symbols on our schedule. To add symbol text to your symbol, first you'll click on the symbol with your mouse, and in the selection tab you should see the text sub-tab for that symbol. So I can add some symbol text to line 1, and make sure you press apply text changes to apply that text. Also on this tab you can move the text around if you want it to be in the middle and to the left of the symbol uh, you can do that. You can also change the size of the symbol text over here on the left but if you want to change all of the symbol text size for all of the symbols make sure you do that in the format tab symbol text. You can also add symbol text onto the middle of a bar. In this example I'll click on the start symbol for the bar and type bar text and press apply text changes. If you add it to the start symbol of a bar you'll have an option right here center text on bar and then it's going to be centered and currently it's vertically in the middle. You can also place it above the bar if you want it to look that way but I think I'll keep it in the middle. That looks pretty good. You'll also see that you can add a symbol date in that same tab, if you have a symbol selected, you can see currently my date is being hidden, but I can place that below the symbol or above the symbol if I want to show that date. Uh, you can also change these defaults on the toolbox when you edit a symbol by double clicking on it, so keep that in mind. And finally, symbol notes. I'm going to click on this symbol down here and in the selection tab, instead of the text subtab, I'm going to go to the notes subtab and type a symbol note. And then make sure I press apply text changes. And depending on your template, it's either going to show the note or you're going to have to activate the note. So over here on the right side, it says display note on schedule. I'm going to check that. And then to move a symbol note, you can just click and drag that symbol note. And the symbol note is going to be locked uh, to the symbol just like the symbol text. So if I click and drag the symbol, you can see that symbol note is going to move with it. Uh, you also have some options for the connector type if you want to change that. Or you can change these background colors, etc. And you'll see if you add a symbol note, it's going to put a little note icon on that symbol. If you don't want to show that, make sure you uncheck Highlight Symbols with Notes, also on that Notes sub-tab. I hope you found this video informative. Be sure to visit our website at kidasa.com or email support at kidasa.com with any questions. Have a nice day.